I hope you all had a great weekend. Uh, I've got some good news and some bad news to deliver. The bad news is I went to the dentist today and uh, he told me I would have to have my wisdom teeth pulled. But the good news is I'm going to assign group projects today and they're worth half your grade. How is that good news? Well, I'm the teacher. Good news doesn't have to make sense. This is going to be your last project and you and your group members are going to be responsible for each other and all the tasks that I assign. Wait, what are you guys doing? You said we were doing group projects. We were just picking our groups. <laughs> Thank you, Brian, but I'm going to assign your groups for you. What? Yeah, that's right. I, I want you to have a chance to go outside your regular social circles. So I have assigned the groups for you. Uh, I think he wants us dead. <laughs> Professor, to be honest, you're just going to split up all the hardworking students and pair them up with the lazy ones. And I don't know about you, but I can't have these slags affecting my grade. And that's why you communicate with each other, all right? How else are you gonna make yourself better if you don't utilize the principles of the program? Class, listen to me. How else are you gonna break out of the mold? You have to make the difference by being the difference. You have to focus on the task at hand. You've got to advance towards your goal, link up with each other. You've got to comprehend each other's views, organize your tasks and assign them. And finally, you can't be afraid to share new ideas. Is it just me, or doesn't it seem like he still has speech from the movie? Man, I feel like just jumping out of my seat and yelling, Carpe diem. <laughs> what does this do? It's due two weeks from today. So let's get started. <sighs> Guys, I don't think I can do this. Same here. How are we supposed to motivate students who aren't self-motivated? It can get bad. We can get stuck trying to pull everyone else's weight if they continue to lag. Or worse, we're all stuck with incomplete projects the day it's due. I don't know about you guys, but I'm starting to lack some motivation too. <laughs> no, not you, Alex. I mean, it's affecting my studies and my other classes. I started procrastinating. <gasps> I don't know how to make it stop, guys. I have to be honest to you. I skipped out on my math class yesterday. What? I mean, Facebook seemed a little more interesting. I feel the same way when I skip my health class. I keep watching Breaking Bad. It's on Netflix, you know? You guys, we gotta pull yourselves together. We don't want to become another statistic. We can't be picking up these bad habits now. We have one more week to finish this. Don't worry, there's still a lot of time. That's what a procrastinator would say. Okay, look, let's not worry too much about this. We're all individually responsible for our own being. For now. Don't be so negative. I'm just saying, I want to hold on to my own responsibilities. I don't want to worry about everybody else. We have to focus on what is right, Riley, okay? I'll try, Brian. Really? A zombie? It can happen. Uh, no more Walking Dead for you. Everybody. It's gonna happen. What are you talking about? The lagging is about to begin. Brian, you need to prepare yourself. I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to handle this. What do you mean? You'll see. It's uh, about time you get here. Jeez. Where's Riley? She's, um... How do I put this? She's gone off the deep end, dude. What do you mean? I don't know. She's been acting and looking kind of different lately. She's, uh... She seems like she needs to go to an emergency beauty salon. Or something like that. Uh, she's been kind of acting funky. Funky.
guys. She's possessed. <laughs> I believe we did. I know. Uh, Where's Riley? I don't know. Have you seen her? No, I haven't seen her yet. Saved your life. You're welcome. How's everyone doing today? Good. 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 Hey, Professor, how did everyone do on their group projects? Well, I won't go into any details, but I have to say that as an instructor, it makes me happy to see my students that push outside their comfort zone and work really hard on the projects. It's actually one of the most rewarding parts about this job. You think the laggers will come back? Uh, of course. I mean, there's a little lagger in all of us, right? We also have a little eye falcon in us, too. People are quicker to recognize the negative in themselves more than the positives. Yes, you have lagger tendencies, but you also exhibit those eye falcon principles. Those aren't just some school tactics for students to follow if they want to get through a class they despise. They are based on real life objectives to uh, help us succeed multiple aspects in our lives. You have to look at the bigger picture and observe that looking outside of the box is a limitation. The right falcon, there is no box, which means there are no limitations, which means everything life tries to throw at you is nothing but a stepping stone for you to reach the next level of your goals. Sickness 